Hi, my name is Ricky. I'm at the Harley Street Clinic today at His Hair. Um, going to get my hairline fixed up. Um, started to lose my hair probably about three years ago, just receding in the sort of sides of my hair, like most people probably find they do to begin with. Um, it wasn't really anything that big a deal at the time, just kind of noticed a little bit of thinning. Gradually as time passed, um, you know, it kind of got a little bit worse. Um, I go to the barbers probably once a week to get my hair fixed up and faded and um, sort my hairline out to make it look a bit sharper. And gradually over time I've had to sort of bring my hairline a little bit further back to compensate for the bits at the sides that are going missing. So yeah, I kind of decided that now is a good time to kind of get it fixed up and get my hairline back to kind of where it used to be and make it look a bit sharper really. I mean, in terms of work-wise, it affected my, my work. I work as a model, so obviously that has a large impact on your physical appearance. So, um, I mean, to try and maintain your hairline, whether it be covering it up with a makeup product or whatever, um, is possible, but it's very time consuming and it never really looks 100% natural. And, and obviously, like, losing your hair in that kind of industry, of course, you know, you're gonna suffer work loss and whatever. So it's, um, I just kind of felt like, yeah, if I wanna kind of maintain what I'm currently doing, then I kind of needed to do something else. Um, and hair transplants and hair plugs and things like that just really wasn't an option for me. Um, I've always worn my hair, like, as a low fade, that kind of thing anyway. So, um, uh, you know, for me, it just really wasn't an option to go down another kind of route. So you know, I'm really pleased that I found uh, a solution that I think is gonna look really sharp yeah hopefully it's going to be looking really good yeah my goal for the treatment is mainly to um, bring my hairline further down a little bit um, as i say i've been i'm um, having to cut it back a little bit further to compensate for the bits that are missing around the edges and um, so bring that forward and just kind of like thicken it out and replace the bits that have kind of like thinning out and gone missing and just kind of end up with like a sharper all over kind of shaved down look which is kind of always what I however wear my hair anyway. Uh, I found out about his hair through a friend of mine who had read something in a magazine or seen something on TV and you know said how great the results seemed to look so yeah I kind of started to research it and and I found the clinic so it's great that there's one here in London because it's very close to where I live so yeah that's um I came in made an appointment had a consultation everybody explained everything to me really fully saw a lot of guys that had the treatment done already so it kind of gave me the confidence just to go ahead and have it done myself. I'm not really that worried so much about the pain um, or you know the procedure of the treatment because um, I've had quite a few tattoos done already um, I kind of know what to expect from that although I've never had a tattoo on my head before um, but from what I understand from the guys that I've spoken to that have had it done it's um, they don't go as deep anyway as what they would normally do in a regular tattoo and the needle is a lot finer so um, yeah, I'm not expecting it to be really that painful. Uh, when I came in for my consultation, they told me that I probably need two uh, treatment sessions, possibly a third one. So I'm not sure you're gonna see how the first two go and then see if I need to come back for another one. After I've had the procedure done, I don't really plan on telling anybody particularly that I've had it done. I'm not gonna be closed off if anybody asks me straight up if I've done something to my hair. I mean, there's obviously people that know me really well and see me regularly are probably gonna notice some kind of difference. So, I mean, if anybody asks me, I'll be quite open to tell them, especially if it's another guy that kind of wants to sort their hair out. I um, mean, you know, I'll be quite open to, to tell them what I've done and where I've done it. But other than that, in the meantime, while it's kind of uh, um, still a bit of a fresh tattoo, I kind of probably wear a few hats during the day until it kind of like heals over completely. And so, you know, I'm not too worried. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to getting started now. I'm getting, looking forward to getting in the treatment room and having it done um, and coming out hopefully over the next couple of weeks. I'll have my hairline back to where it used to be. Hopefully that will um, you know, improve things work-wise as well as confidence and um, won't have to be edging my hair up daily in the mirror with a razor. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to getting going.